Hello everyone and welcome to our new lesson for today. Why don't you open page 106 because read 106 and the title will be At the Beach. See, the title is At the Beach, di tepi pantai. Okay, down here it says holidays at the beach. But now we all know that uh, it's PKP or MCO movement control order. So we cannot go to, uh, to anywhere and we have to stay at home. But it's okay once everything finished, you can ask your parents to bring you out to the beach. Okay. Beach dalam bahasa, bahasa Melayu ialah pantai. Okay, today uh, we are going to study about things you can do at the beach. Okay, let's see the instruction. Listen and look. Listen and say the words. Awak dengar dan tengok aktiviti-aktiviti yang boleh dibuat. Awak dengar teacher sebut dan sebut bersama-sama dengan Saya, okay. Let's go to number one. Let's see number one. Can you see the boy with blue cap? Can you see the boy with the blue cap? Yes, it's number one. He's holding a fishing rod. So what is he doing? Okay, so let's pronounce it together. Catch a fish. Catch a fish. Tangkap ikan. See the fish? Okay, dia tengah tangkap ikan. So, let's go to number two. What can you do at the beach? Apa yang awak boleh buat dekat tepi pantai? You can say, I can paint a picture. I can paint a picture. Can you see the girl? She paints a picture of a hill. Okay, let's see number three. What can you do at the beach? Apa yang awak boleh buat lagi? Aktiviti apa yang awak boleh buat lagi dekat tepi pantai? Okay, number three. You can see. Uh, you can say, sorry. You can say, I eat ice cream. I eat ice cream because the weather is nice, it's hot. So, I'm sure you want to eat something that's cool, right? For example, ice cream. Okay, let's see number four. What else can you do at the beach? You can say, I can take a picture. I can take a photo. Can you see the boy with orange shirt? He's holding a camera. Maybe he took a picture of his friend. Maybe dia dah takat gambar kawan-kawan dia. So, nowadays, you can also use your smartphone to take pictures too. Awak boleh guna smartphone. Okay, let's see number five, people. Number five. Listen to music. So, what else you can do at the beach? I can listen to music. Saya boleh dengar lagu. Can you see the girl with yellow hat? Well, maybe it's too noisy over there or maybe she just want to listen to the music at the beach. So, she listen to music. Okay, next is number six. What else can you do at the beach? I can look for shell. Shells, dalam bahasa Melayu, cengkerang. Saya boleh mencari cengkerang. See, the girl, she collected quite a lot of shell, cengkerang. So, I'm sure some of you may have some collection of shell. So, if anyone does, you can share your collection of shells to the WhatsApp group, okay? Okay, let's go to number 7. Read a book. I can read a book. What can you do at the beach? I, you can say, I can read a book. Saya boleh baca buku at the beach. Okay, last one, the number 8. 
What can you do at the beach? You can see, make a sandcastle. See the girl with pink hat? She makes a sandcastle. Okay, so please look at the spelling of the word sandcastle. S-A-N-D-C-A-S-T-L-E Sandcastle, not sandcastle, okay? Sandcastle. Alright, so they are all, all together eight activities that you can do at the beach. Now, I'm going to show you a little bit more of pictures at the beach. Unit 9, the new topic, okay? Okay, now, let's see the pictures. You see the boys, the two boys with one girl there. Uh, they want to make sandcastle. Okay, now it's a picture of playing ball. Collecting shells. Tang uh, tengah mencari cengkerang. Alright, first here. Uh, what's this? Catch a fish. Okay, now I want you to pronounce the words uh, with me. Awak sebut dengan saya bersama-sama. Kita tengok spelling. Okay. Catch a fish. C-A-T-C-H. Catch a fish. F-I-S-H. Fish. Catch a fish. Okay. Next one. What is this? What is this activity? Okay. Paint a picture. Okay. So let's spell together. P-A-I-N-T. Pain, Lucas, a picture, P I C T U R E, picture. Paint a picture, melukis gambar. Oh, wow, what's this? Looks yummy. Apa ni? Eat ice cream, makan, makan ice cream. Eat dalam bahasa Melayu, makan. Okay, makan ice cream. Eat. E-A-T. Eat. How to spell ice cream? I-C-E. Letak dash. Ice. C-R-E-A-M. Ice cream. Okay, what's this? What is he doing? He's taking a picture. Okay, take a photo. Spell take a photo. T A K E Take Ambil a photo. P H O T O Photo. Take a photo. Tanka Gamba. Here this one. Listen. Listen to music. Very good. How to spell listen to music? L I S T E N. Listen. Dengar. Music. How you spell music? M U S I C. People, please remember the spelling of the word. Jangan tengok je awak kena. Uh, kena tahu macam mana aja. Okay, so uh, this is a picture of uh, the friends. They are making the sand castle. Make a sand castle. Membuat istana pasir. Istana pasir. Okay, make dengan perkataan build. B u i l d adalah uh, mempunyai maksud yang sama. Membina. Make dengan bill maksud dia sama. Membina istana pasir. Sand castle. Jangan salah sebut eh. Sand castle. S-A-N-D. C-A-S. T-L-E. Castle. Sand castle. Okay, last one is collecting shell. You should know how to pronounce it. Shells, jengkerang tu apa? Okay. So, all together are eight activities, right? So, what What is your task for today? Alright, so, I want you to take out your English one. 
Okay, your English one is um, single line. Your single line book, right? So, I don't have any single line book. Saya tak ada um, buku bergari. So, I'm going to use this. Saya nak guna yang ini. But first of all, before you start, you have to write down the date for today. 7 of July. 7, 7, 20, 21. And the day for today is Wednesday. Wednesday. Don't say as Wednesday. It's wrong. It's Wednesday. And write down the topic. The topic will be at the beach. Okay. The thing that you have to do is you have to copy. You have to copy back. Okay. Copy back all the eight activities that you can see in the textbook. For example, number one. Um, cash a fish in your textbook catch a fish okay so in the textbook they didn't write in capital letter and they didn't also put full stop so what you have to do is you have to copy back write it back with capitalized so see when you start a sentence, you have to start with capital letter. Kena mula dengan huruf besar. So, awak kena tukar yang huruf kecil itu kepada huruf besar. Awak tulis semula. Cash. Uh, fish. Dan penutup kena letak titik. Ingat, mula dengan huruf besar dan kena ada full stop. Okay. Lepas tu, awak kena selang satu. Please leave a blank below. Selang satu ya. Nak buat apa-apa kerja pun kena selang satu. So that uh, your writing akan nampak kemas. Okay. So selang satu, nombor dua. Nombor dua apa? Awak tengok balik. Nombor dua ialah I can paint a picture. So mula macam mana pun kena huruf besar. Okay. Buat sampailah nombor empat, lima, Enam, tujuh, lapan. Sampai le nombor lapan last kali. Okay. That's all for today. Nanti hantar apa yang awak tulis ni dalam uh, group WhatsApp. Okay. Bye.